You're listening to Menopause Natural Solutions, episode 78, Menopause Makeover. Welcome to Menopause Natural Solutions, your podcast for all things perimenopause, menopause and beyond. Stay tuned as your host, naturopath Jennifer Harrington, explains how to use natural therapies to find your ultimate health and happiness during your transition. Hello ladies, I'm super excited today to talk to you about my menopause makeover program. Have you ever wondered why some women just breeze through menopause and others really struggle? We all stop menstruating. The production of estrogen, progesterone and testosterone all reduce. So why do we have totally different experiences? Dr. Sandra Thompson from the University of Western Australia says if menopausal symptoms were due solely to hormonal changes, then the menopausal experience would be more homogenous. So what factors make or break your experience of menopause? I have identified three major factors that either set us up for success or a problematic transition. The first being diet and nutrient levels. The second being environmental toxicity and your ability to detoxify. And the third being stress and lifestyle habits. And this is exactly what my menopause makeover program focuses on. This three-month program takes a deep dive into each of these areas. February is all about nutrition, and we'll be using my new app. This app provides you with the meal plans, recipes, shopping lists. It also allows you to track and measure not only what you have eaten, but your results as well. But what I really love most about this app is the reduction in decision fatigue. Most women constantly think about food. What should I cook for dinner? I wonder what's in the fridge. You know, we're all guilty of those kind of thoughts pondering over food. But can you imagine a life where this is reduced and having so much more mental space for other things? Dinner is planned. The food is purchased in the right quantities with no waste. In my household, I have a whiteboard on the fridge with meals written down for that week. This also reduces the annoyance of other household members asking, what's for dinner? We sit down once a week and look at the recipes and we either agree or swap out the recipes for others more suitable for the household's palate. Yes, there are lots of extra recipes that aren't on the meal plans for this very reason. There is also a self-paced education module So you can learn about the importance of certain menopause superfoods and how to incorporate more of these into your diet. There is a live Q&A with myself to go over all your nutritional questions. The second module, which will run in March, is focused on environmental health. And we are so lucky to have building biologist Joanne Leah run this part of the course for us. And that name may sound familiar because I've previously interviewed Jo on the podcast. Last week's episode, number 77, on mold, water damage, homes and menopause, and also back in episode 61 on environmental health. So you may like to to go back and listen to those episodes if you miss them. So Jo is going to walk us through common sources of toxicity in the home and what to do about them. She will start in the kitchen, looking at water quality, food quality, food storage, and cookware. Next to the bathroom, to look at personal care products, shower filters, and cleaning products. 
In the living room, she will address air quality, furniture and flooring. And to finish off, she'll end in the bedroom, looking at mattresses, allergens, dust mites, mould and EMFs. Jo will also host the live Q&A session to answer your environmental-based questions. April is the lifestyle module. And this is back to me. I'll be running this one for you. And the main focus here is stress reduction. We will investigate the role of breath, meditation, movement, with examples for you to try at home and demonstrations as well. Our new app allows you to track the amount of exercise, meditation and sleep you are getting. The final part of this module is all about sleep. How much you should be getting, tips to help you get to sleep faster, deeper and longer. There is also a live Q&A session that I'll be hosting in this module. How you treat your health now will determine the quality of your life later. Wouldn't you prefer better temperature regulation, abundant energy, a great night's sleep, to be the ideal weight, to have stable moods, a strong memory, and most of all, to feel healthy and happy? If you are finding your health slipping, it's unfortunately only going to get worse unless you take action. And if you do take action this weekend and join the Menopausal Makeover program, there is an early bird special. So this is an additional module that I'll be running and I'll run it in March and it's all about testing. So in February, you'll receive a list of the tests that we're going to be discussing so that you have a month to either track down your old results or to take new tests if you haven't tested these before. And I will walk you through the optimal ranges. See, when tests determine these ranges, they look at the results that 95% of the population get. And I don't know about you, but I certainly aim to be healthier than 95% of the population. So you can see that these ranges are not optimal. In some cases, you really want to be at the low end of the range. And if others, you want to be in the middle and others you really want to be up and over the high end of the range. So I will walk you through how I read results and provide tips to help you improve yours. So guys, just to summarise, the menopausal experience is not only about your hormones. It's about your general health, your nutrition, your toxicity and your stress levels. This is why we all experience menopause differently. From February, I will give you the chance to join me in a three-month menopause changing experience. February is a deep dive into nutrition. March is a deep dive into environmental health. And April is a deep dive into lifestyle habits to reduce your stress response and improve your sleep. This Saturday, Saturday the 23rd of January, the doors open for the early bird special. So if you join Saturday or Sunday, you'll receive the additional module on optimizing test results. And this special is only for the first 48 hours. So why not join the wait list so you don't forget and don't miss out on this offer? But in case you're listening to this podcast and it's already been and gone, you can still join the three-month menopausal makeover program up until the 31st of January because we start on the 1st of Feb and I want us all to start together. And guys, the earlier you sign up, the earlier I'll give you access to the app so you can go through and start looking at the meal plans and the menus and go out and do your shopping so that you're all prepared and set and ready to go come Monday, the 1st of Feb. So guys, I look forward to getting to know many of you and watching you transform your life and your health. If you do have any questions about the program, please feel free to email hello at Menopause Natural Solutions and one of us will get back to you as soon as possible. But I, I hope to see you in the program. Bye for now. 
for listening to Menopause Natural Solutions. This podcast contains general information about menopause. It is provided as a guide and it is not intended to replace medical advice. Opinions of guests are their own and this podcast does not endorse or accept responsibility for statements made by guests. If you have enjoyed today's episode, please leave a rating and review.